check out these ears. Ready? Da 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 da! No! She hates it, but it's so cute. So cute to see Max at the window once again. <laughs> Just patiently waiting for someone to come back home. Kind of dreading going inside though and seeing what a mess there may possibly be because I've left him out all day. Good afternoon by the way, I'm not actually even sure if this will be the first clip of the day because I don't know if Ray's filmed anything today but if it is, hello, welcome to the vlog. I'm home and I am about to go inside and hopefully see no mess or ruckus because Max has been out all day and it was a test to see if they could handle it. Hey Max, how you going? How's your day been? Oh, I can hear her. Hey beautiful girl, how did you cope today? Oh, you've opened a cupboard, that's fun. You look like you may have gone to the toilet only a couple of times and not on the pad. That's also fun. Did you miss me? Did you have a good day? Yeah? <laughs> yep, all right, let's go outside. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Be free and go pee. Good girl. You're such a good girl. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yeah, you do. Oh, okay. There's a belly rub. There's a belly rub. Oh, okay. You gonna roll over? Oh, okay. See ya. I'm literally home for about 20 minutes and then I have to leave again. Um, I've got an appointment, so hopefully Ray will be home before I leave. I'm just having a bit of fun here with Trixie's ears. I don't know if you can see her. Check out these ears. Ready? Da, da 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 No! She hates it, but it's so cute. Trixie, are you listening? Can you hear me? Look how big her ears are. Like, they're actually quite big. They just look small because they're folded over. Can you hear me? I'm sorry. I'll stop touching your ears now. I hate having to leave you again. I don't want to leave you. I just want to stay here and cuddle. She feels so much more like a dog now. Like I can let her run around and she's fine. Just when we're not here, that we're still kind of figuring out what to do. Good night, guys. Um, had a big day at work today. Did a uh, like a 12, 13 hour shift. So got home, had dinner. Thank God, Lauren had some delicious uh, beef. I don't know if it's satay, but this is like a beef noodle. It was delicious. I think I'm about to have a shower and go to bed. Pretty stressed out about this job at the moment, so that's why I haven't been on the vlogs much. Just been going through the motions. Job finishes tomorrow, so hopefully um, I'll be a bit more upbeat and feeling better now already. Trixie's uh, pretty crazy still. It's pretty cool, she's able to run around now. Trixie! But she doesn't really come when you call her when she's uh, on a big sniff beat. Uh, pretty cute, she's running around chasing Max. Max isn't attacking her, so I don't know why he's not having a swipe at her when she's chasing him. He's just kind of backing up and running around, so I think he's he's okay with it. She isn't too aggressive. She'll just run at him. It's not like she, she's trying to bite him or anything just yet. What are you doing? Trixie, what can you see out there? Come on, Trixie. Come back inside. Come back in here. Come on. Go, Trixie. Come on. Come on. Yeah, good girl. It's pretty cool that she can jump back in here now. So we can leave the gate open, she can jump in, jump out, get a drink of water, maybe even put herself to bed. That would be even crazier. So yeah, I think I'm gonna shower, bed, and then wait for Lauren to get home. Or it might actually be asleep by the time she gets home. Hey, good evening, everybody. I am home, and I'm just having some cuddle time with the girl. Don't fall backwards. Yeah, you did that to yourself. Chilling out with her, sort of trying to wind her down before bedtime. Ray's in bed and I'll be heading there soon, just need to end the vlog. There's this weird thing where she just sits on you and she's getting off now but she'll literally, she does that occasionally and just like sit on you in a weird position. She's got her first vet visit tomorrow um, where she'll be getting her stitches out which is where she was desex so she was getting those stitches out which means we can actually introduce her to things like water and stuff which is exciting. She'll just be getting like a regular check up and stuff just meeting her vet which I think is really important. Hopefully she likes them and they have a connection and all of that stuff. It's bedtime mum, what are you doing? I'm not playing. My question of the day to you guys is, do you have like a regular doctor, regular dentist, regular anyone that you like have seen since really a long time? So like your early childhood or just for like 
years that you've seen them. I never really had a set doctor as such. I just kind of go to my local GP and see what happens. I did have a regular dentist for a really long time and I've always remembered his name because his name is Dr. Smiley and I always thought that was hilarious. Yeah, I just find it good if the dog can see the same vet all the time just because they know them and it, gets, it gives them something else to be excited about so rather than the vet being like this scary thing. But let me know in the comments below. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Good morning, afternoon or night, whatever it is where you are and we'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye. Say goodbye to the vlog. You say bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> she don't care. I don't antagonize her too much. Don't just sit right next to her because that'll do something. I haven't forgotten you though. I love you. Love us? I'm not sure. Okay, fair enough.